three drinks here and shit. Mm. What it is, what it do, Cyber World. It's your girl, the one, the only, Ash said it, Ash said it dot com. I'm here at the studio of Angela Gillum. We are getting color. It is birthday Eve. Yes, it is birthday Eve. It's the Eve of One's Earth Strong. And as you can see, I'm getting color for real. You know, people always like playing with color and saying, oh, I can do color. Like I went to a professional, okay? Because I myself, I, I did not go to cosmetology school. Even though you can read the instructions on the box, it ain't the same thing as if you actually do a real for real color. So I went to a professional, you know, and I got 20 plus years as a cosmetologist and, you know, she's my sister lock consultant. You know, she keeps my locks lovely, darling, lovely, always lovely, beautiful. So yeah, so we try some color. She's in the background, you know, doing what she do, just cutting up as usual. But, you know, we're in the studio, we're getting some color and stuff done. And, um, yeah, lots is happening. So yesterday was kickball. Woo! Kickball kickoff. It was quite interesting. Hmm. Shout out to B-Dub and the rest of the hustling honeys. You know, we represent out there for, for Gwinnett and all those great things. So that was fun. Great, great time with them out there. Um, yeah, we got our first game coming up this Saturday. Hmm. B-Dub is pushing up. Two practices for this week, Thursday and Friday. Lord, help me. Please, Jesus. Okay. Because Angela sounded like she got to hook up with some stuff back here. We ain't going to tell nobody. You know what I'm saying? Since a lot of people be listening up there, listening in and saying, you know how we do. Anyway, so, <laughs> but yeah, so we're here. I'm getting color put in, as you can see. It's going to be uh, a red. We're going to get some red color put in. You know, just in time for ATL Carnival. You know, Carnival is actually next month. And um, I'm going to be out there on the road the 28th. May the 28th is a Saturday, I believe. And I'm going to be out there on the road. You know, booty out, boobies out, everything going to be out. So, that's why I got to go to kickball practice twice a week. You know, to get everything right and tight and looking at, you know what I'm saying, tonage and all that good stuff. Glitter. We got to get glitter because glitter deflects stuff. See, glitter will distract people from the parts that are not as flattering as others. So, glitter, bronzing, that's another friend of ours. We like bronzing. We will bronze stuff. So, that's going to be fun. But also, May the 13th, and this is no laughing matter, Gwinnett Relay goes down at the Gwinnett Fairgrounds. Gwinnett Relay is the event that happens every year for Gwinnett. Uh, Relay for Life is an event that happens all the time. So, everybody is always doing... Relay for Life in their cities, all across the nation, all across the globe. And it benefits cancer research. It benefits the American Cancer Society. And um, I'm in charge of entertainment for this year's uh, festivity. So entertainment is already closed off. I appreciate everybody that contacted me about performing for this year's stage and everything else that we've got going on with it. We appreciate you guys so much, but we are no longer taking any more performers because now we're down to the nitty gritty. Now we've got schedules made out. We're mailing out passes. All that great stuff. If you want to be on the bill for next year, you need to email me. Info at ashsetit.com. Info at ashsetit.com. And I'll get you on the bill and I'll get you set up for that. So that is pretty much what's going on with that. Um, if you want to volunteer for Gwinnett Relay, we still need volunteers. It's a whole lot of work that goes into it. That a lot of people don't really understand. Be it that we're the world's largest Relay for Life event that goes down. So... If you want to volunteer for Relay for Life, you can email me personally, info at ashsaidit.com, info at ashsaidit.com, and let me know your information. We can get you all suited up, suited out, all that great stuff, and we will see you on May the 13th. Let's see. Think, think, think. Think, think, think. You know, Winnie the Pooh used to say in a cartoon, think, 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 think. No, think, yeah. Winnie the Pooh. Pooh Bear. Yeah, I ain't got no sense, y'all. Look, it's birthday Eve. It's birthday Eve. That's all, that's all that matters. It's birthday Eve. I want to act silly. I want to act crazy. I'm going to do it. Because that's how it makes sense. All right. See? Angela Gillum agrees with me. Why Why don't all of you? Hmm? <laughs> Anyways, um, <laughs> uh, we've got blog features. Blog features on Ash. I'm trying not to get this stuff on me any more than I already did, but, you know, it's already it's, it's already everywhere. Hmm. Um, <laughs> the Runchy side, I appreciate you. Thank you for always showing support. Thank you for tuning in. Um, <laughs> uh, 
uh, blog features. We've got blog features on ashsetit.com. Blog features are 25 bucks. So if you have a feature event that you want me to talk about, or discuss, and publish to the audience, if you've got new music that you want to talk about, maybe a book project, anything that you want to announce, 25 bucks, you get featured on the Ashton blog. We, our blog goes daily. Every single day of the week, we've got a new blog feature. You can check out my Instagram at one love ash, the number one love ash, and you can check out those blog features by using hashtag blog feature. Hmm, checking that out. Go on to there and get that done. On ashsetter.com, there is a button for blog feature. So if you want a blog feature for your event, your logo, your new company, whatever announcement that you want to announce to the Ash Set It catalog and the Ash Set It audience, definitely shoot me an email with all the information, info at ashsetter.com, and include all of your graphics, pictures, logos, all your verbiage, all your copy. I'm not going to create copy for you, okay? You have to tell me what you want to feature on the site. So we do what we do. You know what I'm saying? We, you ain't give me no extra work. That ain't that ain't happening, okay? On a birthday eve, we're not doing that. Right. Why do you? People continue to play with me. I don't understand why. <laughs> Um, and people that want to book me for their weddings, and I and I appreciate that. I, I love you guys, and I thank you for reaching out to your girl. But you're going to need to reach out uh, more than 24 hours in advance. I had somebody today, Angela, I kid you not, that emailed me at 2 p.m. for a 5 p.m. wedding today. And I looked at the email because I was like, maybe, I, maybe it came yesterday. And no, it came in today. April the 3rd at 2 p.m. for a wedding at 5 today, downtown Atlanta. And I, as much as I appreciated that, I had to decline. Less minutes like that, I mean, unless I just ain't got nothing else to do. You know, I'm all humbug. I'm just sitting up at the house waiting for you to email me. I got stuff going on. Look at this here. I, I, got, I got stuff to do. 5 p.m.? No, I got a date with Angela Gillum's studio to get my hair done. And ain't nobody going to take this away from me. Look, her calendar is full out for the rest of the year, all right? I can't afford not to be here at this appointment. I can't do it. Y'all just want, y'all asking too much of me, girl. You're asking too much. Too much. It's too much going on in the world. And I can't do it. I can't do it. So I'm here to get my color in and the retie. And um, so, Angela, how long is this? should this color be in? Or are we going to say minutes five minutes okay See, that's, that's about the same as the box you know what i'm saying but is it is a different um it's, it's a different brand than the box one yeah. it's a lot different no you, you ain't gonna get the same effect from the box trust and believe yeah but they don't last no that's the thing about it they, they, it doesn't last or um they you know people try to like i said take cosmetology 101 through the box yeah. And um, they end up burning up their hair like I did. Hmm. So we don't want to overprocess hair. We don't want to burn hair. So we're gonna follow instructions from you know professional that's been doing this for years. <laughs> um, I'm serious. Well, I don't know why you laugh. Why everybody always laughing at me? I be serious. And folks be laughing. Everybody be laughing. I'm dead serious. But no. So we're definitely um, getting this color in. Um, that's pretty much the story. I love you guys to pieces. We're going to end off this uh, Periscope here. Uh, anything that you want to do in this life, you need to reach out there, branch out, do it. Don't let anybody tell you that you can't do it. Just because they're telling you they can't, that you can't do it means the opposite. You can do it. And they're going to try to discourage you. And they're going to try to downplay what you're trying to do. It's all because they see you as a threat. They know that you're about to do some major, major, massive things. Don't give them the benefit of the doubt. Don't give it to them. Knock out the ballpark. I said it. Yeah. <laughs>